Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. We've got another six star to open up for you guys, a basic. And we've got some assorted crystals. I have a Woman of Power crystal to open up. And I'll probably open up a few uh, five star uh, featured. There's Toad in there, just opening them up just because. So let's go ahead and uh, get started here. And I guess we'll start with the Woman of Power Crystal. We've got one. And I believe that's the last one that we will have. Uh, when I opened up uh, the other ones, we still got a few more shards and I was able to get another one. Um, I didn't realize I would or else I would probably just waited and opened everything up together. But um, this, sh I believe, is the last one. I could be wrong. You know, we're at the end of the month here. So we'll see what happens after that. All right, what do we got? Can we get a six star woman of power? And we get a three star. Good thing these are uh, free. No surprise whatsoever. Okay, uh, let's see. I have anything else on this tab? I got a login crystal. We'll just pop it. Yeah. I get pretty much four stars from those. You can get a four or a five star, but I get four stars. All right. Uh, let's see. I think that's it for that tab. All right. Let's open some featured. And the only champion in this entire crystal that I don't already have is Toad. So that's the only champion that would be new. And right now I'm preparing to grind for Nimrod in the basic arena. So any new champion would be great. Give me more points in the arena. Um, but... A first time awakening would also be nice. And I don't think, well, see, Null, I don't think I took him to 200 already. And a lot of them, I, I stay at 180 just in case. All right, let's see. You could have stopped right there. But it's Anti-Venom. Now, <clears throat> I've heard Anti-Venom is actually pretty decent. I still haven't really played around with him. I have him as a six star. So, you know, I don't know that much about him, but I have heard he's uh, a decent champion. All right. Let's see what we can get here. Icarus also, I like using, at least in the arena. Uh, he gets those energizes, so he builds up to power quickly. And I fire that special two, and the special two usually finishes the fight. Um, and if it doesn't, they're hurt really bad, and the fight doesn't last too much longer. So I like him because he finishes fights pretty quickly, at least in the arena. All right, let's see. I see Toad around there waving his tongue at me, saying, ha-ha. Whenever he comes to the basic arena, I'll grab the five star. So even if we don't get him here, I'll grab the five star when he comes around to the basic. So it's not not too big of a deal. Ooh, she's getting up there. I remember when she was my power control option. Yes, give me those six star shards. Yummy. All right, and we got one more. And we do have another Cavalier, just a regular Cavalier uh, to open up. And then we will get to the six star. But yeah, so when Toad comes to the basic arena, round one, I'm probably going to just go ahead and grab the uh, five star. If I don't get him here, if I do, then I'm not going to even bother. 
as far as the six star goes, probably not. But I would get the five star just to collect, you know, for collection purposes. Got to catch them all, right? All right, final one for the video. Final featured five star. Hmm. That was completely underwhelming. It's a good thing I'm past five stars. <laughs> Using that much for a uh, featured and getting Red Skull. Oh, I would have raged. <clears throat> but these days, opening the featured, not that big of a deal. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, da 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 da. Okay, so we got this uh, Cavalier. And let's go ahead and uh, spin that one out. Hey, I saw Jubilee as a six star in there. Um, that'd be cool. Any new six star out of this would be crazy good. Uh, and if we could get a six star awakening, woo, that'd be great too. But we both know, we all know what's likely to come out of this. But I have gotten six stars in the past, so it is possible. There is a possibility. So, will it be a three star? Will it be a four star? All right, what will it be? And it's a three star. That's pretty much what I figured. Even if it had gone over one to uh, Mysterio, that would have been great. But I have him. I think that might have awakened him. I'm not sure. But it still would have been a dupe. It wouldn't have been a new champion. But maybe we've gotten all the bad luck out of the way. We'll see. All right. So, okay, that's it. That's it. All right. Let's open this six star. So let's grab it, go out, come back in, go out, come back in, a little pep method, shout out to pep1000. And let me pop this up so you guys have at the bottom of your screen, my most wanted champion. And on the other side of the arrow, those are the champions that I want to awaken the most, all right? So Cosmic Ghost Rider would be phenomenal. There are champions that I would not mind just getting more SIG levels on. You know, like Hercules, would not mind getting more SIG levels on them. But ideally, I would love to get a new champion, more points in the arena, especially since I'm about to grind for Nimrod. Uh, so that would be awesome. But if we get a dupe, which is more likely because I have quite a few uh, six stars these days, um, maybe it'll be one of the champions on that list down there. All right. What do we got? Come on. Somebody good? Somebody new? Hey, that's a new champion. I like it. Okay. A new six star. So that's more points in the arena. And Sassy is pretty decent. I like it. I like it. Okay. Okay. So that any new champion is going to be a reason for me to rejoice because it's more points in the arena. I don't have even arena teams yet. Right now, this means I need one more. So if I do pick up that Nimrod, then I will have even arena teams. So yes, I love that Sasquatch. Okay, so that's gonna do it for the crystal opening portion. Since it's a new champion that I got, I'm gonna end the video with a little bio scroll thing about Sasquatch. So you guys can end the video here or you can read a little bit more about Sasquatch, all right? So that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.